Today, we're going to be answering the question of what does sugar do to your body and the 10 negative effects of sugar. We'll also answer the question of if fruit is good or bad for you at the end, so don't miss it. Number one, sugar can give you wrinkles and adds age to your face. Scientists from Leiden University Medical Center in the Netherlands measured the blood sugar levels of 600 men and women aged between 50 and 70. They then showed the photographs of these people to 60 separate participants and found that those with higher blood sugar looked older than those with lower blood sugar levels. In fact, for every one millimeter per liter increase in blood sugar, the perceived age of that person rose by five months. Number two, sugar is associated with acne. Foods ranked high on the glycemic index such as sugar and refined carbs have been associated with greater amounts of acne on the face and body, according to the latest research. A study of Australian men showed that those who ate a diet with a low glycemic load saw a great reduction in overall acne. It was a small study with only 23 men, but is still food for thought. Number three, sugary drinks cause an 83% increased risk in developing type 2 diabetes. In one study of 91,249 women showed that those who consumed one sugar-sweetened beverage a day had an 83% increased risk of developing type 2 diabetes compared to those that only had one a month. Number four, sugar intake increases the risk of developing certain types of cancers. There has been a direct link seen between breast and colon cancer with sugar consumption. This is likely due to the fact that insulin is one of the key factors factors behind the growth and multiplication of cells and sugar spikes insulin to abnormally high levels. Number five, sugar can ruin your teeth. A study done by the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition showed that sugar destroys the healthy bacteria in the mouth. This can cause tooth erosions and may dim that bright smile. What about sugar and weight gain? There are five reasons why sugar can cause us to gain weight. Number six, sugar is the premier definition of empty calories. It has no real nutritional value, no nutrients, no minerals, no proteins, and no fiber. Because of this lack of nutrients, number seven, sugar makes you feel hungry. In a study done by Yale University, those that consumed sugar had an increased appetite and desire for more. So not only does sugar fill you up with empty calories, it makes you want more of those calories. This process happens when sugar screws up the hormonal levels in the body, which leads to number eight, sugar blocks leptin and raises insulin to supernatural levels. Leptin is a hormone in charge of telling us that we're full and need to stop eating. It also tells us that we have energy and should go out and use that energy. Sugar consumption blocks this hormone from doing its job and from reaching the brain. Sugar also spikes insulin, making it very hard for the body to access and burn the stored fat on our bodies. Number nine, sugar causes belly fat. Numerous studies have shown direct links from sugar to the increased accumulation of belly fat. This is the worst kind of fat because it is the one associated with all sorts of diseases, including the world's number one killer, heart disease. Despite knowing all of this, it's hard to stop eating sugar because number 10, sugar is addictive. Similar to drugs like cocaine, scientists have shown that sugar causes a very similar dopamine release in the brain. Studies on neuroplasticity have also shown that drug users have very similar behavioral addictions to those addicted to sugar. Point blank, sugar is addicting and it comes without the immediate social repercussions of frequent drug use. That's why it's so hard to stop eating it. How much should you eat per day? None. There is not a real reason to be eating this food in your diet, but only on the rare occasion as a treat. What about fruit? Fruit has fiber, vitamins, minerals, water, and tons of nutrients that refined sugar does not have. This is why when studies compare diets with refined sugar to fruit sugar, the negative effects are not the same. That being said, you will want to pay attention to fruit sugar if your goal is weight loss. Things like fruit smoothies are not good for weight loss goals as they do still have sugars even though those sugars are natural. Sticking to whole sources like apples, oranges, and berries are a much better idea. What should you do if you can't stop eating sugar? I think the subject needs to be covered in greater detail, so either next week or sometime soon we will be making a video about breaking sugar addiction if that's something you guys want. Breaking a sugar addiction is a great way to help the body lose weight, but of course cutting out sugar isn't the only piece you need for fast and effective weight loss. There are 10 important scientific steps that you must understand to get fast and consistent weight loss results. These basic steps are the sometimes surprising reasons why people struggle so hard to lose weight. If you're curious about those 10 steps, go ahead now and click the screen. It's going to take you to another page where you can drop your email and in return get access to the video of the 10 steps for fast weight loss success backed by science. Got a question or topic for the health nerd? Just put it in the comments section below. And rumor has it, for every new subscriber I get, a new Emperor Tamarin monkey is born. So please subscribe to the health nerd for healthy tips and tricks backed by science. Cheers.